If you thought bare knuckle boxing was a thing of, a thing of the past, think again. The legendary John L. Sullivan made the sport famous back in the late 19th century. But bare knuckle has made a resurgence now in the 21st century when Utah is quickly becoming one of the best out there. Fox 13 sports anchor Morgan Vance shares that story. This isn't Hollywood, <laughs> nor for the faint of heart. It is all over, just like that. You ever on the receiving end of those pops? It can't feel too good. I mean, I've, I've had my fair share of licks, you know, so I know that I'm going to take one or two to get one, but I don't care if I take 10 or 15, as long as I get my one, then I know I'm going to hurt you. Meet Jerome Hatch, nicknamed the Hatchet. A local MMA fighter who, as of last August, entered the crazy world of bare knuckle boxing as well. I had a friend who was like, hey, you need to get into some training. I will pay for your training. Like, you have something in you. You know, they see it. You, you, need, to, you need to do it. Hatch was raised in Utah County with boxing in his DNA. His grandfather fought competitively with gloves decades earlier. Was going through some stuff and found some of his old newspaper clippings. And he was like, look at Grandpa. Like, we thought, uh, thought the world of him. Rest in peace. But for Jerome, his fighting resume had consisted mainly of schoolyard brawls. Some legal trouble followed before one last date with the judge caused him to rethink his priorities. He said, next time I see you in here, I'm, I'm going to throw the book at you. Time to replace testing the law with testing opponents in the ring. I'm like, hey, this is, our, this is your shot. It's up to you now. Shane Stoneman took charge as Hatch's coach. I assume most fighters aren't suited for bare knuckle, but he is. Why? Every time he fights, um, it's never a dull moment. If people want to come to see a fight. That's why he's the biggest draw in Utah. And I knew if I'd get him a shot in the bare knuckle, that is where he would excel. And he has recently flying overseas for the first ever bare knuckle boxing event in the Gulf region. The city of Dubai taking the main event and cruiserweight belt. Hatch is bringing a storm so far early in the fight. He certainly is. 20 pounds of metal and bling dating back to 1884. It's the oldest belt in combat sports. It's what all the belts originated from. It's a really good thing to have, man, and, and it's mine. Hatch will next defend his title in London this June. Been a crazy journey with him. Epic. From Lehigh, Morgan Vance, Fox 13 Sports.